All right, so a lot of you have been asking me about a nail tutorial. So tonight I'm going to redo my nails. They're getting kind of long and I don't know. I don't, I'm not loving this color that much anymore. So first I have to take this off. Be right back. So I use pure acetone. You can buy this from Sally's or Amazon and I put the cotton on my fingers and we wait five minutes. All right, so now that I've got most of the color off from the powder, I'm gonna take this tip off and I'm gonna use a 240 sanding bit to get just the rest of the color off so the nails are clear and then we will shape. All right, so now I have all my nails shaped and all of the powder is off. I always first apply to the whole nail a clear first just to make it a little bit stronger, fill in any of the gaps where the growth, the new growth and the old growth come together. You can get this at Sally's Beauty Supply or you can get it on Amazon. So here we go. Okay, so now I'm gonna do tips. And to do tips, you have to have one of these, which you can also get on Amazon or on Sally's. At Sally's, you put your finger in there to where the line is, wherever you want your tip to be and that's what you use. So I'm gonna use this baby doll pink for the base and the white for the top. Now that you've got the process, repeat it twice. All right, now that we've done step one and we have dipped our nails, now we apply the activator, which is step two. All right, now that we've got everything activated, here comes the fun part. This is where you really shape your nails to exactly what you want them to be. You use the drill to make sure that they're smooth and that there's no, sometimes the powder goes over into the crack of your finger. You wanna get that off. And then you buff and then we put on the top coat. So here we go. All right, so now my nails are buffed and shaped. I'm about to use this little tool to go under the fingernail, and then I'm going to use step three, which is the top coat that makes everything so shiny and pretty, and you leave that on for five minutes, and I'll be back to show you the finished product. And now you have beautiful sparkly nails that you can do at your own home, and you know what? If you get tired of them and you don't like them anymore, you can just fix them.